Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Tech Warrior channel. This time Russia has again shown or told the world that its technological capabilities are very real and deadly. S-300 missiles are a formidable force in modern warfare, renowned for their exceptional precision and range. Capable of locking onto and intercepting targets moving at immense speeds, these missiles exhibit an unparalleled ability to track and neutralize aerial threats, including fighter jets navigating at considerable distances. Their sophisticated radar systems and advanced guidance technology empower them to swiftly detect, track, and engage airborne targets with remarkable accuracy, making them a substantial deterrent on the battlefield. The S-300's capability to effectively target and take down fighter jets, even when they are maneuvering at high speeds and considerable distances, underscores its status as a potent defensive weapon system in the realm of air defense. The sheer lethality of the S-300 missile system is a testament to its technological sophistication and combat prowess. Its ability to engage and eliminate fighter jets operating at substantial ranges speaks volumes about its capacity to handle dynamic and high-speed aerial threats. The launch of the Russian S-300 missile air defense system and the Buck air defense system created deep unease among American officials. Both systems are known for their powerful anti-air capabilities, capable of threatening America's operational capabilities and air superiority in a potential conflict scenario. The resulting reaction included discussion of steps to maintain America's technological and strategic air defense superiority. U.S. officials continue to monitor developments in Russian air defense technology and conduct in-depth analyzes of how the effects of these systems could impact future U.S. military and diplomatic strategy. Russia's decision to activate and place these air defense systems in its defense strategy has created new concerns in the Pentagon. In addition to panic and concern at the government level, the U.S. defense industry is also under pressure to respond to these technological advances. This is a concrete example of the arms race and power competition between large countries that continues to take place on the global stage. Amid all this debate, it is important to find solutions that promote international dialogue and cooperation. Efforts to build trust and improve communication between countries can help reduce anxiety and minimize the possibility of unwanted conflict escalation. Thanks for watching. See you the next videos.